Welcome to another product update video where we're highlighting the hottest releases from HubSpot in the past month, and this month was a doozy. We had our first ever Spring Spotlight. It was this cool digital asynchronous event, and we announced all kinds of things. A brand new content hub, a reinvented service hub, lots of things happening with commerce and AI. It's a lot to cover, but we're gonna hit as many of the highlights as we can. Let's get into it, starting with Content Hub. Content Hub is the new kid on the block. We've added a whole bunch of new content features to what used to be CMS Hub, and one of the coolest ones is content remixes. What you can do here is you can take an existing piece of content, such as a blog post, just select one that you already have, and then you can have the AI repurpose it into a variety of other formats. Let's say you want a social post. Let's say you want another blog post. Let's say you want to send an email. Let's say you want to make a landing page. You select the formats you want. You can give additional information if you care to. And then look at this. It is simultaneously creating these four assets for me. And when they're done, they'll be full assets inside of HubSpot. So here's a social post already done. I can save it and edit it in the social app. And the same thing is gonna happen with these other three content types. Another cool thing in Content Hub is our podcast tool. You can host a podcast on HubSpot. You get this RSS feed that you can feed out to Apple or Spotify or wherever you want your podcast to be distributed. You can create new episodes either by uploading existing audio that you've recorded yourself or by generating audio from a text. This is really powerful, gonna help you get your podcast up and going in no time. Another cool feature inside Content Hub is brand voice. We're gonna talk a lot more about AI features in a minute, but as you have AI generating content, you wanna make sure it stays on brand, and brand voice does exactly that. So here I am inside the branding kit that's existed for a long time in HubSpot. There's now this brand voice section where you can choose personality characteristics, tone characteristics, you can provide additional context like your company mission, you can feed it sample text so that the AI knows what your brand voice sounds like and it can mimic that and enforce that in content across all formats. Next up is Service Hub, which has been around for a long time, but it just got reinvented with some sweet new features. Let's take a look. First up is Help Desk. This has been in beta for a while, but now it's fully live. This is a single workspace experience for all of your support teams to work in across all channels. If you're accustomed to having multiple different shared inboxes, that's going away. You can now have everything in one place, all your teams working together to meet your customers' needs. Beyond customer support, we now have a customer success workspace. This is brand new, just announced at Spotlight, and it's so powerful. If you've seen the prospecting workspace inside of Sales Hub, this takes some cues from that, but there are some important differences. Beyond this summary page where you can see your tasks and schedule and embed reports if you would like, there's this new portfolios tab where you can see the accounts assigned to you. So here I'm seeing a list of all the companies that are assigned to me, which is great to see this in a single place. But maybe you're thinking, oh, we don't use the company object, we use a custom object for our accounts. And maybe you're thinking, oh, the standard company owner property, that's not the one we use. We made a custom success owner property. This can accommodate that. Check out these settings. Here we're gonna decide what object is pulled in. It defaults to companies, but all of your custom objects are available here. And you can choose what owner property we're using. So if you have a custom success owner property, you can use that. You can also include renewal dates if you've created a custom property for that. This is really gonna revolutionize the way your customer success teams work inside of HubSpot. Check out the beta, and if you think it's a good fit, opt yourself in. Next up is Commerce Hub, which is now available in our free tier. So even if you're not paying for HubSpot at all, you can process payments inside of HubSpot. And we recently introduced the ability for you to bring your own Stripe account, which opens up a world of possibilities. If you work in multiple currencies or multiple geographic locations, you can now have all of that commerce data flowing into HubSpot and use our commerce tools in conjunction with your Stripe account. Last but not least, we got to talk about AI. There's a lot going on. Let's check it out. AI is woven deeply into Content Hub. You already saw the podcast tool that uses text-to-speech and the content remixes tool that changes one type of content into another one. We also have an AI blog generator, which can write blog posts for you based on the ideas you give it, or it can even generate ideas for you if you don't know where to start. But AI isn't unique to Content Hub. We've been adding it to all the hubs. So let's look at some other AI powered features outside of Content Hub. So here I am in the workflows tool, which you can use to automate all kinds of things in HubSpot. When you're adding actions now, you can use an AI assistant to turn your text into actions for you. So you write a description of the actions you want right here in the prompt box and select generate actions. In this case, we want to wait five minutes then send a welcome email and assign a task to the contact owner. And if we let the AI do its thing, we see we have our five minute delay, we have our welcome email going out, and we have a task ready to go. This is going to save you a lot of time building complex workflows. 
As I said, we're adding AI-powered features in all the hubs. We have AI-powered chatbots and service hub, AI-powered sales forecasts and sales hub, AI-powered marketing email, subject lines and preview text and marketing hub. We even have some AI-powered features in the mobile app. Be sure to look around, keep your eyes open for the little AI icon. There's lots of new features to try out. This is just a sampling of more than 100 feature updates that were released as part of our Spring Spotlight. Get the full digital experience by going to houselot.com slash spotlight. Be sure to check out our release notes to see everything that's new this month. Subscribe to the channel for more videos like this one, and we'll see you next month on another product update video.